It's so epic. Hello, and welcome to the Switch Underground. Today, we are going to play the Book of Unwritten Tales. We are on episode 5. <clears throat> Excuse me. When we last left off, we were getting started on our first day of school as our little gnome boy. And we left off in that room right there. And now we are off to meet the head master. I think we've checked everything in this room. For sure. Well, let's go. I new headmaster before I leave the school. I want to make what? a good impression, so I mustn't keep him waiting. Ew, he must be in this other room. Those are some switches there. We're not sure what they do. Uh, is that the leave? Put the switch. Lever. No idea what it does. Pull it anyway, dude. Or don't. That's fine too. There we go. So the headmaster, we know he's not a magician. He is in a political role, basically, in our school that just appeared. That's our room. We just came from here, dude. So... Puzzle number one is... How the H do we meet the headmaster? Oh, he must be in this room over here. That one. Let's meet the guy himself. Hopefully he's nice. I'm doubting it. Oh wow, he looks like a turd. Headmaster Block. Ah, Professor Weatherway. That's me. There you are at last. I have some tasks for you. Tasks. I look forward to us working together. I'll be frank, Professor Weatherway. You have a mage diploma, but have not completed the tests required in order to work as a teacher. That's a not true. Tested credentials, a written application. Nothing. You are only here on the Archmage's recommendation. That's right. But there's currently a shortage of mages, and everyone must do their best. That's do all we want to do. Do best is well and good. But it does not replace the formal and mandatory training for teachers of higher magic. I hate this guy. You know what? Let's just get down to business. We don't want to... We don't want to make waves. You, you you mentioned tasks earlier, Headmaster? Yes, you have two tasks. Good. As you know, the Archmage is coming early tomorrow to officially inaugurate the school. I met him in the hallway. Important political and business personages will be attending. And as you can assumedly see, the school is not in a presentable condition. Oh my god, I gotta clean Council this shit. Council Leader Van Buren has hired a caretaker, but he cannot do the work alone. Your okay. tasks are to help him clean the floor in the entrance hall and remove the cobwebs by tomorrow. Okay. You support the council leader in the election, right? Indeed I do. We need to build up an extensive bureaucracy and boost the economy as quickly as possible. Time to get down to, to me, what this a hole's about. The appears to be a more logical choice than a mage. But do not worry, Weather Vane. I don't blame you for your political naivete. As a school headmaster, I am neutral and always act according to school rules. Mm -hmm. And of course, political influence in schools is prohibited. Tell that to Council Leader Van Buren. Hey, oh, you don't want to push that button, bro. What's that? Oh, well, it's one of the campaign brochures the Council Leader put in my classroom. Hmm. I'll, um, I'll take care of it. Yeah, right. But the Archmage Alistair trusts me to teach Screw here Screw this school. guy, we're gonna go for it. Well, yes. Mages have a well-known penchant for chaos. Oh, wow. I'm this... still trying to get an overview. The records management in this school defies description. Well, it's been gone Council for 20 years, Van dude. Buren wants to reorganize this educational institution and finally bring structure into the place. And she has my full support. Correct management of the teaching records must once again become the teaching staff's primary task. What, like take that and roll? That is the only possible way to institute efficient control of learning and teaching methods. There's two students, bro. I may have no formal training as a teacher, but I managed to thrill my students in the very first hour. I performed a spell, and you could really see the way they caught fire. Not literally, of course. It wasn't a fire spell or anything of that sort. This guy does not you care. You performed a spell? Yes. 
and now they want to learn to do the same. They want to learn. According to my records, history of magic was on the syllabus. Yes, but... Professor Weathervane, crucial to our success in teaching is that we provide students with a stable, reliable framework and adhere to the curriculum This guy's like exactly. Dolores Umbridge's evil yes, uncle. Yes, but the students... Had you enjoyed proper training, you would have known that. I will note this failure in your file, and in the future, you will stick to the curriculum, dear colleague. You know what? Write me up, dude. I don't even care. About cleaning the hall, is that really my job as a teacher? Yes, indeed. A school is a team endeavor, so that means you have to do what I tell you. If if you told me to get rid of the flying kobolds, that I would have understood. Oh, I'm not sure he knows about those, dude. Flying kobolds? If there are flying kobolds infesting the place, they must be got rid of too. See Crap. to it, Weathervane. Floor, cobwebs, flying kobolds, fix them. Huh. And apart from cleaning, what else is there to do? The inventory has revealed that a number of items of school property have gone missing. Among Good. other things, the school library. The whole library has gone missing? Well, that that's... is correct. <laughs> I asked that's bad. the Archmage about the matter, and he confirmed to me that the room was there before. Okay. He does not know where it is now. He said something about its being in hiding, perhaps, or away traveling. I think it's unseemly. I want that room. We are a school, and we need a library. Agreed. But where shall I start looking? That I cannot tell you. You are the mage. You ask a lot. Uh, I, 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 I don't know if I can get all this done by tomorrow morning. Believe in yourself. By tomorrow morning? You have until 72 o'clock. 72 It's not even a time. I have developed my own efficient metric system of measuring time. A day has a hundred hours, consisting of a hundred minutes, with a hundred seconds each. Everything else is too confusing. So, um, okay. I don't even have until tomorrow morning. For a properly qualified teacher, even the impossible poses no problem. Or should I note in your file that you do not feel up to the tasks assigned you? No, I'll, I'll, I'll do it. We'll do it, dude. Very good. And then you can call it a day and prepare tomorrow's lessons. Easy. One thing's clear. Headmaster Block wants me to fail, but I won't disappoint the Archmage. Dude, we'll and take secondly, care of business. I like this school, and a school library would be great for the students. Too bad it's and hidden third, somewhere. Traveling. The work the headmaster has given me is the perfect opportunity to keep my eyes open for Remy. Okay. this back in make sure we are still recording here okay now what is this? The school was founded over 500 years ago. There must be thousands, maybe tens of thousands of files in it. That's the school file system? There's no way he's gonna let me search that. Okay, we'll start with A. Allardyce, Albert. He seems to be an excellent student. There are many entries about improper interjections and questions. And what's this? Oh my god, there's so many. Do I really Axel need to take all these? Axel cannot pay his school fees as he gives all his money to dodgy game developers. True. Beaverus Deepwood. Beaverus tried to turn wood into gold. In the end, he got mahogany, which in turn he sold for a lot of gold. 
Okay, let's go back. Um, F through J. Oh my god, there's so many names in here. I'm just looking for anything out of the ordinary. I mean, ooh, whoa, this one's got stars. Marco, Marco intentionally uses words like and because he believes it would be too embarrassing to write them down here. <laughs> Marcel makes a lot. Marcel summons large hairy mammals and refuses to stop doing so. Okay. Ooh, ooh, this guy at the bottom looks funny. Omadomadillo. Omadom was expelled. It turned out that he was an armadillo in a penguin suit with a sign that said Moo. Wow. Okay, now that's just weird. This whole file cabinet's a little weird. Uh, P through T. There's going to be some good ones in here. Peter Troll. Russell the Undead. Oh, wow. Sasha Shalislashlatshu. This entry was only added to make life difficult for anyone who has to read it out loud. Sorry. That's exactly hey, why we selected nice. it, dodgy game developer. Ooh, look at this one. Ferragor Beeratan. Ferragor lost today's archery contest after he fired his arrow in the wrong direction. We sent oh, no. his family flowers. And the speedster? This is going to be a flash speedster. reference. Document not found. Did you mean speedster or speed star? Hmm. Papa the Great. Let's see who's in the U's and the Z's. Nobody. Okay. So we have some files. Is he working for the school or himself? Or is he only interested in gaining the council leader an advantage in the election? Well, let's be honest here. Probably a little bit of both. Oh, display case documenting the achievements of pupils of the school. Some sports trophies, pictures Quidditch. of slain dragons, pupils in front of smoldering pots. Okay. Mm, pride of place seems to go to a trophy won in a broom ball tournament. A broom ball tournament? You mean like broom Quidditch? Went by a different name. It was played on broomsticks using six winged balls. But there were legal complications. That's why today resembles nothing more than soccer, except that each player has a broom strapped to their back. <laughs> the display case can't be opened like that. It's locked. Oh, okay. Broom ball is but they Can't open the display case. We're definitely gonna have to turn on this bells. fireplace. They really get a fire going. When my family wanted to forge something at home, I was in charge of the bellows. Okay. You are the most important gnome in this matter, they often used to say to me. I'm definitely going to have to use the bellows. This must be the best clock in the world. Most only have two or three hands. This one has at least ten. Well, when you're trying to count to a hundred really o'clock. the clock wants to tell me, but I'm pretty sure it doesn't just show the time. I There's so much to discover. Believe I you. wish I could stay here forever. But we have to clean. Wait. Take the bellows. Okay. We're gonna need it those. Says, Fireplace travel network map. It shows a lot of fat black dots connected by lines. Oh. Above each of the dots is a name. Sea stone, mage tower, entrance hall, coaching in Fox's Den, uh, and many more. Three animal symbols are located beneath each of the dots. Okay. I've heard about this. Wizards use a powder to travel through the fire in one fireplace to the fire in another. Like the flu of course, network? this doesn't just work with any fireplace. It must be on the fireplace travel network. And this plan shows which fireplaces are connected to which. Okay. So we have a fireplace the dots, travel the network. Lines lead away from the... Oh, the if this oh crap! The fireplace here in the staff room is connected to the fireplace in the missing library. The library is represented by the symbols owl, worm, owl, and rat. Hat. Oh, owl, worm, fire, rat. fireplace, travel powder, and a little luck. This could be my way into the library. Okay. The fireplace. Here, I need a fire. Together with some fireplace travel powder, this fireplace could be my ticket to the library. Where the hell am I going to get fireplace travel powder? Together with some. What's this right here? 
A neat pile of firewood. More than enough to make a decent fire. Agreed. Take some firewood, dude. We need it. It's really cold in here. I'm gonna light a small fire, okay? Do you intend to burn school property? Oh, no, shut up. I'm... There's some firewood right here. Yes, and it belongs to the school. Oh, sure. We're not getting anywhere with that guy. Ooh, what is this? Oh, how pretty. A swan folded from a piece of paper. This is origami, an ancient elf art form. The dwarven word for this art form means something like pointy ears build dust catches out of paper because they can't deal with stone. <laughs> Take it. Gonna need that. Hey, this isn't just some sheet of paper. It's... Sorry, swan. It is another book page. I'll take it with me. So I have all these book pages. I mean, I'm supposed to assemble them into something, right? Do I want to talk to him? Nah, screw that. Maybe he has something to say. Excuse me, Headmaster Block. Yes? Why do so many of the notes on your desk have a small hole in the middle? That's airmail. You spike the message on the beak of a homing pigeon. Not an optimal method. First one obviously that doesn't has a seem hole nice the paper, to the pigeons. And secondly, the pigeons are constantly flying into cliffs. Because uh, they can't see. I think it I think there's a simpler solution. And that would be You could simply write the letters directly onto the pigeons themselves. As long as the pigeons are white and the ink black. The text should be clearly visible. Hmm, not a bad idea at all. But it would make the archiving more difficult. True. Records seem to be very important to you. Order is very important. Records are a tool to that end. I have a loose leaf binder for spells. Hmm, commendable. Maybe you can do something with this then. You're giving us something? There is no room for a spell in my files. Archive it, Mr. Weathervane. Gladly. Ooh. My book of spells is coming along nice. So, I'll get back to work then. Be my guest. So, what do I have here? I got my loose pages. My automation spell, which I will need for cleaning. Dry boards. I can use that to start a fire. Yellowed design drawing. A fire maker is an amazing piece of engineering. You fill it with flammable gas, which is then ignited using complicated technology. Okay. Fire maker. What is this? Spell. Someone has written a note in the margin. Headmaster Pinkerton. His spell is currently circulating throughout the school. It opens tabs, knots, loops, and the like. Okay. By now, there is hardly a student or teacher in this school who still has their pants around their waists and not their ankles. We need to stop this immediately. That's funny. <laughs> it seems magic isn't always limited to serious things. Well, no. The Let's spell worked excellently. Well, you know, even if the fairies do look a bit strange. Oh, that's the I fairy think spell. I've summoned enough of them for now, though. Yeah, I think so too, dude. What else? What's this one? The nibbled notepad. Oh wait, I wanted to look at that. Master Marcus's number won't help me anymore. Sharp fishbone and my wand. Sometimes my wand works perfectly and sometimes less so. I don't I bet I could put these boards in the fireplace. I don't think I'm quite ready to start a fire yet, but I hope that is not school property that you intend to burn there, Professor Weathervane. Just a few old boards. From the school here? Yes, but you should have thrown them away. You should have thrown them away, but you didn't do so. I thought to myself, why throw away the boards and waste expensive firewood? Why unnecessarily burden school finances? There you go, hit him where, he, hmm. where it counts. Good thinking, Professor Weathervane. Carry on. Wowzers! Even outside the classroom, this job is more complicated than I first thought. All right. Got our That's boards in there. Start. 
However, I can't light the wood direct. We don't have any powder, so let's go into the other room. I don't think we can do anything with these. We got our coins. A few old coins. They must have been underwater for a long time. You can hardly see the deep. I wonder if I give the coins to the dude if he'll be happy about that. Probably. If I find a couple of old coins here in the school, who do they belong to? The heirs of the original owner. If they are not found, the state. Possibly also the school. Although that depends on the circumstances. Mm -hmm. So they wouldn't belong to me? Absolutely not. Well, I... It was just a kind of general interest question, really. Fine. Hey, there's a little rat hole there. So there was a kid's name from the... The school the, uh... was founded over 500 years ago. There must be thousands, maybe ten. There was a name on the machine in my room. I should look up that kid. But first, there's a giant dude in here. Holy shit. Whoa, the new caretaker troll. He's eating a mop. Oh. Um, hello. I'm, I'm Wilbur Weathervane. P Professor Wilbur Weathervane. Okay. I, I, I teach, so I, I'm pleased to make your acquaintance. If you were to talk to me, we could work together to accomplish much more for the school. Come on, I demand that you talk to me. Oh, great. Someone else to make demands around here. Oh, he talks. What are you doing? What does it look like? Brushing your teeth with a mop. It looks like you're cleaning the hall. Well, now and then, a little. Yep, it's my job. I'm a janitor. What of it? You've been a caretaker for long? What exactly are your duties? I run the place. Oh. Nothing here works without me. Just no one notices, that's all. Buddy, I. See. I... But don't I the see teachers you. and the school administration, etc., have a small share in the success of the school, right? No. <laughs> what success? You've had a look around this dump. It's disgusting. All dirty and run down. Yes, it's quite dirty here, in fact. But isn't it your job to do something about it? What do you think I'm doing? Ah, could take a while until you're done cleaning up the mess, right? Yeah, if you say so, Mr. Know-it-all. I bet Council Leader Van Buren got you the job here. Of course. She wanted the best. Oh, You're great. the best. I think she'd be perfectly happy if no progress was ever made here at the school. Know what your problem is? You're a windbag. Bert thinks so too. Who the hell's Bert? Bert? Buddy of mine, he thinks you're a windbag too. But I don't even know Bert. Even we just met. So you're saying I'm lying? Bert That's must be exactly his tiny what little Bert friend somewhere. And the others hate about you. There is no Bert. You really live in your own little world, you windbag. Headmaster Block has ordered you and I to clean the hall and free it of cobwebs. Already on it. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, but it doesn't seem to be progressing. Oh, you could of course do it better. Not that. He's gonna Only leave. Maybe. Maybe you could use some help. Do you have any other cleaning supplies? A broom, dustpan? Sure, got it all. But I ain't giving you none. Get your own. What's your problem? I'm offering you help and saving you a lot of work. Oh, boo hoo, cry me a river. Look, you were told to clean the entrance hall. I was told to clean the entrance hall. If we work together, it will be faster for both of us. Don't you get it? Sure, Professor Brain should know. The rest of us are idiots. What well, crap up this guy's that, ass? But it is a fact. Don't know about anything, but wanna play the big man here, huh? It is quite obvious that. No one else has allowed an opinion. We had that here before, you know, rotten fascist. I, uh, I don't want to fight with you. 
Your parents are siblings. Yeah, all three of them. Wow, this is like the old school insult battles from Monkey Island. Come on, seriously. I could really use your help. Please. Can't cope with your life, huh? And now you want me to fix it for you, just like always. You've never helped me. We we, we don't even it's know. Can't say, you. dude. Oh, how a fine gentleman considers himself something better now, and suddenly doesn't know us anymore. I wonder if they were from the first game. I'm slowly beginning to believe you actually find it funny to wind me up. Everyone hates me because I'm so cool. <laughs> I'm sure they don't. You say do. People say that I'm arrogant, but how should they know? Oh, I'm giving time of day. And you know what beats everything? Bert. No? No beats. A hammer. <laughs> Idiot. Wow, we got a goddamn comedian. I'm keeping an eye open for a friend, so please let me know if anything unusual happens in the school. <clears throat> well, you know, if for example someone's wandering around the school who has no business here, or if things disappear, or, you know, things like that. There was a penny stuck in the door. You what? There was a penny stuck in the door. Wouldn't open. Classic ah, trick. That's probably not important. Did you put the penny in there? Me? Uh, no. If I find a coin in there, I'm taking you down. A coin It where? was nice talking to you. I really don't understand why so many people don't want to talk to trolls. Arseholes, a lot of them. I don't want us to speak our minds. And I think that's wrong. That's why I let you. Never yeah, but then you run down everything I say. Who made you sheriff here? This school is going downhill and has been for a long time. Ever since you and a few others came here, there's been nothing but stress. What others? Um, hang on a minute. Isn't this your first day? Didn't used to be that way. But now everything has to be politically correct. Or you get silenced immediately. Yeah, well, well, goodbye. Hello? <sighs> Headmaster Block wants to get rid of the cobbles. Didn't tell me. But he did tell me, and I want you to help me. <sighs> want whatever you want. It ain't gonna happen. I know why you don't want to help. You can't. You're neither smart enough nor fast enough to catch oh, the cobble. Oh boy, we're gonna play devil's oh, advocate here. A little reverse psychology. Can, that's for sure. But I don't have to prove anything to you. Why are you like that? Like what? An so a unfriendly, destructive, and, and such an ass. Trolls, troll. Oh, now it makes sense. <sighs> Never mind. I like the cobbles. To be honest, he's a troll, I'm he even proud trolls. Of them. Okay. Yeah, I've seen better. Yeah. However, it would make me really angry if someone scared the cobbles off. Huh? You talking to me? <sighs> Things can't go on like this. Is that we all need you want? To win him over. Be a right pain in the ass all you like. Someone who just annoys others without ever lifting a finger. Oh god, he got one. Blah 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 blah. What is it? Finally notice your own stupidity. You, um... Want to apologize? Ha, <laughs> loser. That was a waste. Jeez, do I continue talking to this Hello? guy? Hello? <sighs> uh, I don't have anything to talk to him about, so that's good. <laughs> okay. Uh, what's this? The door to the magic school actually consists of several doors. One for the large creatures, such as trolls. One for humans and elves and the like. And? And then there's one for gnomes and dwarves, and one for even Tiny smaller one. beings. That is supposed to symbolize that everyone is welcome in the school. But in reality, graduate majors are almost exclusively human. I'm the first non-human to graduate in many years. Guess that's why my door hinges squeak. Uh oh, it saved. Why is it saving? I can't leave until I've complete. I don't want to let the up. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have some fun. I want to bring this armor to life. Where's that? Yes. K. 
cast it on the caretaker troll? Shit, dude, why not? Hmm. Can I use it to make him work faster? Probably. Oh, this is going to go well. I should do it. Using Damn it. magic to compel living creatures to do something against their will. Ugh. I didn't become amazed to do things like that. Yes, you did, Wilbur. Say it with me now. Imperio. No? No. Okay. Fine. Uh, let's see here. What can we do? We can do the fire. You know what? Let's use our magic wand on stuff. Zap those cobwebs, dude. Shit. Nothing. Probably hit a hole. Or it didn't actually do anything. All right, let's try. Um, let's try the wand up on that one. Blast him, dude. I don't think I'd hit him. I'm not a very good shot with the magic wand. You had to walk all the way over there to say that. Come on, dude. Okay, what else is in here? Oh, now he's moving. Oh, open the. Oh, the. Oh, that's right. It opens the window. Now I can operate two levers. Okay, let's open this one. It's the window. Go ahead, buddy. Fly out. Okay, he doesn't want to leave. What if I pull this other lever? Okay, that opens the bottom window. So, let's close the this one. Or that opens the top. Let's close the bottom. There. Now get out. Bro, the window's open. You know, we're just gonna leave both of them open. And when you're ready to go, dude, you go. Uh, what else is here? Uh, let's take a look at these cobwebs again. Those are the cobwebs the headmaster wants me to get rid of. Not only are there a lot of them, they're much too high for me. Hmm, look at the stairs. I'd love to know what's on the upper floors, but it's far too dangerous. A magical building that's been left on its own for two decades has magic seeping through the walls. Wait, 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 wait. The kobold's ready to go. Here. Lead him. Oh, wait, that wasn't the right one. Okay. Later. Yep. Dang it, I thought he was outside. Okay, well that didn't work. Let's get him back on the window. Okay, now let's get him on this window. Keep that one open. Then when he goes and lands on the other window, we're gonna close it. Maybe he flies out the bottom. Any minute now. There you go. You suck. The tapestry is in a miserable condition, like everything here. The colors are faded and hey, there's even a loose thread. Pull it. tapestry seems to be magic. At first the thread was very short, but now it's at least four paces long. I'll rip it off and take it with me. You can never have enough magic thread. Okay, we're gonna have to build something. We're gonna have to MacGyver something here, dude. We have the fishbone. Was there something we needed to repair? Oh shit, he's back up there. That one. Okay, now fly out the bottom window. hate you. There. Be free. When you're ready. For now, we have the sharp fish bone. Wait. The sharp fish bone. Mm, I 
could pull the thread through the hook at the end of the bone and use it as a kind of a needle. It worked! And I can even sew! Mm -hmm. Mum showed me while Dad was teaching Sydney how to weld. Now, was there something that I needed to fix? An improvised needle and thread. Okay, good. Uh, let's go back into my room here. Wait. I can use it to sew my loose leaf pages together and make a book. Assuming I have all the pages. Here, let's use it. I could sew the pages into a choir later, but I still haven't found all of them. Shit. Still missing a few pages. Alright. Haven't found all the pages. What can we give the troll? Maybe some money. Nope, oh, the troll does not want our money. Let's see, what else can we give the troll? Um... How about... What was this? Let's deselect these. Okay. Or don't. Okay. Good. Let's give the troll this money. A few old coins. A few old coins. Uh... Oh, we tried to give the troll the money. It didn't work. We wanted to give the troll this paper. We want to give the troll this paper. Okay. Can't give the troll the paper. Alright, let's go back into our room. Actually, what was down on the ground there? Yeah. What's that? How can I ever get the hall cleaned up? And by, um, 72 o'clock? Bro. You were supposed to, to, to... Okay. There's something we gotta try with that kobold. I don't know what it is yet, but let's go back in our room here. Oh, one's there. Oi! Stop that! He kissed the picture of the princess. Probably better if I put the book in a safe place. Okay, we got the book. What about that piece of paper? This is table. the desk that Chantal, the daughter of the council leader, and little Timmy. Hard to imagine two students. Timmy, though. Okay. Um, this machine. Let's take a look at that machine again. I want the name of the kid. If I need fire, maybe the old fire maker could help. Oh, yeah. Hmm, nothing. Either it's broken or missing fuel, or I'm not using it correctly. I would have to learn more about it. Who made it I don't again? know how the machine works. I... Well, let's see. I have this fire spell. Don't I? Is there anything in this room to use this on? There is not. What about magic wand? Nothing to use the magic wand on either. What about the bellow? Man, I gotta get my selections down. Okay. Nope. Bellows. I won't go pressing the handles together. Forces the air out of the tip. Took me a while to figure that out. But I've got the hang of it now. Good. Select it. Anything in here to use it on? No. Fine. Open spell. For opening tabs, knots, loops. Although... Do I have anything that's locked? Maybe not. Okay, so... Little ash, but also some unburned waste. Here's a sheet of paper. Oh, part of my book. 
Another book page. I'll take it with me. Looks like someone wanted to start a fire and burn the book page. Okay. Looks like we just need to keep looking at stuff. He was crazy about the book of fairy tales. Well, rather, the picture of the princess is in it. That's just not right. He's a bit of a pervy kobold, dude. Okay, what else? So there's the plant there. Can I use anything on the plant? I don't think so. Let's go look at the desk again. I wanted to ask the Archmage whether good teachers can expect any other form of payment than apples. But when he showed me the beautiful contract with the seal and all that, it just didn't seem to be the right time to talk about gold. Well, we got our treasure, didn't we? Package? When did that What's get here? This? A gift? For Wilbur A. Ooh. What is it? Invisibility cloak. Wow! That's... What is it? I'm a magic slate. Oh, cool. A talking slate? I can speak, write, draw, calculate, sing, write poetry, and vibrate. And answer almost any question. Wow! Really? You look like you're pretty expensive. Thank you. We got an iPad and with Magic Siri your in it. You're mine now. The gift wrap and greeting card seem to indicate that this is the case. Okay. But who is A? Insufficient parameters. Maybe Alistair, the Archmage. Definitely Siri. Mordred, Vivian, Leslie, Alistair, Archmage of Seastone. He probably thought I might need some help. How nice of him. Vivian, <laughs> Can you be used to play games which appear to be free at first glance, but in the long term empty your pocket and leave you destitute? <laughs> no. I am a tool and was not designed for unproductive activities, such as games. That's what all kids tell their parents. Hmm, I bet you're really useful. Insufficient parameters. Oh, Christ. So let me get this straight. I can write on you. And paint, and do you know any spells? No. Uh, can you give me any tips on how I can do my tasks? Unless it's about recipes, probably not. Recipes. Ah, I like you anyway. Okay. Um. Yeah. Over and out. A magic slate. At the moment, I have no questions. We can get that guy down with some more uh, pretty princess picks, dude. He'd like to have the book back, but if I give it to him, he'll just take it and fly away. Well, then just, you know, flash him some pages. Look at the, why does this keep wanting me to look at the table? This is the desk that Chantal. Hard to imagine two. Timmy, though. Okay. What about uh, the brochures? I don't know exactly what. First, and then they said weight should be decisive. The more you weigh, the more weight to your vote. But then the trolls and ogres would have been overrepresented. In the end, they agreed on a minimum age. However, there are still arguments because rats, undead children, and other minorities can never vote. Well, that's unfair. They live here too. Um. Okay. The apparatus. The plant here, though. The plant's going to do something. Oh. I shouldn't do that too often. The room could fill up with gas. One I've got spark, it, dude. And we'd have the same result as the devastating spring explosion in Gnome Hole. I've got that it. That was the time the granddad lived on nothing but beans for two weeks. Okay. So we're actually going to use the bellow. And suck up the gas cloud. Got it. And now we're gonna go stick our gas in the apparatus. That's something you would put on a Tinder profile for sure. Put the gas in the apparatus. It's 
It's all working now, right, dude. Then. If this gas isn't flammable, then I just don't know. Flame on. Done! The machine is refueled. Here we go. Do it, dude. Eureka! Who am I talking to? There's no one here. Hey, there's ah, nothing. Ah, the gas burns with a nice steady flame. And because it burns, it no longer smells. Oh. Ah, the gas. And because it burns. Alright. So, I have fire. What am I going to do with it? Um, can I put my book back together now? Do I have all the pages? I could sew the pages into a quad. No, not yet. All right. We have flames. We lost and we still have we still have our bellows. What can we set on fire here? Why work when Let's go back in our room for a second, see how the how the rabbit's doing. Not great, dude. Wait, what's up there? Feel the heat. Ow! That stone is definitely more than just warm. Well, now there's nothing in here to do except the crystal ball. Master Marcus told me everything I need to know. Hold you. I just wish I wasn't in. Okay. Mages use ball. He'll know. All right, nothing to do in here anymore. So we're in the classroom. We have fire. Oh God, there he is. He's back. Let's um. I can't nail him with the wand. Shit. How about how about we show him the show him the princess book? Use the book to lure the kobold into the trap. There's a trap. Oh, the desk. Uh, maybe I can lure him into a trap. Sure. Hey, look that book. Get in there, dude. Ah, got him. I have you now. Well, sort of. Locked up in a dark place with a book of fairy tales. Hmm. Time to negotiate. Hello. Can you hear me? <coughs> I got nothing against you, but you have to leave the school. It's too dangerous here for you, and you're interfering with the routine. <coughs> I'm going to slowly open the desktop now. And you're going to come out peacefully. It's not gonna work, dude. Right then. Ah! Ow! Oh, sorry, I, I didn't mean to do that. I should probably make the best of this. I'll just keep him in the pencil case where it's safe. Did we knock him out? Oh, crap. Oh, 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 I think he's woken up. And he's looking for trouble. So I have a kobold in a pencil case. Still missing. Is that is that what I'm what I'm seeing here? Okay, so we have fire. We have our room. Nothing left to do in there. Nothing here. Now we got to go back here. I'm gonna sort this out, dude. Now, let's bad tempered kobold. Ooh, yeah, there you go. Sick it on the troll. He smashed the Absolutely other one. Absolutely not. He pounded the other kobold to mush. I don't want anything bad to happen to my little wing friend. Okay. Maybe we should use him on the door. Let him out. Maybe none of this. Okay. How about the slate? 
At the moment, I have no questions. Oh, I have tons of questions. Like, where the heck am I supposed to go and what am I supposed to do? But, you know, whatever. Um... Nothing in here to fix. That kobold up there. Gotta get rid of him somehow. I'm pretty sure he's the next key. Reach him up there. Hmm. Well, it's not just that he's very far away, he just never stops flying around. Let's go in here. So I have a fire display case. If I sick the kobold on the dude. fella would certainly provide a good distraction but right now I have no reason to distract the old oh sugar okay let's use our brains got the fairy spell nibble notepad the automation why work spell when you can do magic why would what are we missing Display case, we've looked at it. Could I should I misuse the broom on display to sweep out the entrance hall? I mean, a broom is a broom, right? Okay. Hmm, unfortunately, I can't open the display case. It's locked, and I don't have a key. Maybe this dude will be able to let us have a key. Excuse me, Headmaster Block. Yes. I met the caretaker, Troll. I know what you want to say. I'm not enthusiastic about it myself. Trolls are sullen, slow, and rude. But what can I do? They have a stranglehold on the janitorial market. We must live with it. Still, There's we a were stranglehold on the janitorial market? What do you mean? Paragraph 1, Section 1. The troll is not allowed to speak with any school employee or student unless explicitly requested. Uh, yes. If I have to clean the hall, is there anything I can use to do it with? The caretaker troll was supplied accordingly. Ask him. I did. That's he doesn't want to give want me to. anything. There you go. You are a professor. He is a janitor. Assert yourself. I will assert dominance. The cobwebs in the hall are a long way up. And? You may not have noticed, but... I'm a rather average-sized gnome. That is no excuse. Get to work. Can't one or two of the cobbles just stay here in the school? After all, they are magical creatures, and students could examine them and take them for walks. Rioting cobbles in my school? I'll have none of it. They have to go. Okay. Ah, oh, shame that. Um... Hmm? Uh, about those... Yes. Hold on. About the fireplace map over there. Yes. It shows several fireplaces in the school. Of course. Large and important buildings can have more than just one access to the fireplace travel network. One of them seems to be in the missing library. Hmm. Good thinking, Weather Vane. Get to the bottom of it. Well, I need some power. I'm already dude. on it. But even if the fireplace was still reachable, don't you need a special magic powder to use the network? True. You need some extremely rare and valuable fireplace travel powder. There's no way he gives it over. Only high-ranking civil servants receive small amounts of it. Thank you. Weathervane, aren't you listening? Only high-ranking civil servants get some for personal use. But I thought I was supposed to find the missing library. Didn't think he would let us of have it. Of course, but without wasting my fireplace travel powder, thank you very much. Shit. I don't know how to get into the missing library without your fireplace travel powder. That's your problem. I assign tasks, you complete them. Or at least try. I think we distract him now. Oh, nothing. Hmm? So, I'll get back to work then. Be my guest. 
Well, now I have a reason to distract him. Haha, <laughs> time for a little distraction. Hopefully this will get Blocky's attention. Hmm? Hmm. So that would be the next... Ah! Ah! Go away! Got it. Did you see that, Weathervane? The insolence! Unbelievable! The things one must put up with here! Oh, please. Appalling, Headmaster! Now we can travel. Now it wants me to open the display case, but I can't. The display case can't be opened like Thought so. Okay. Let's use our powder. I should start a fire first. Oh. That's a okay. good start. However, I can't like Um There. Better not. That sheet won't Wait. I don't know how to conjure fire. Might have been part of my mage training, but I never learned. Are you serious? Great. Now I need to set something on fire. First, we need to assert our dominance over the troll. Oh, hello. Ah, why have you always got to be in my face? We're the boss. Headmaster Block has ordered you to give me some of the cleaning supplies. Right. So, you, you're doing it? Of course. Not. Then, give them to me. Oh, sure. You're making fun of me, right? No. Ah, no matter what I do, you're not going to give me anything to use to tidy up, right? Of course I will. Ah, this guy is a troll. I'm going to get a broom myself. From the locked cabin. <laughs> Should I talk to him again? Uh, I don't have anything to talk to him about, so that's good. All right, let's see here. What else do we need? The cobwebs, the shit in the room. Need some fire. Empty dried food package, nibbled notepad. At the moment, I have no questions. Well, I have some questions, like... How the hell am I supposed to get some stuff all right let's go back into our room yeah let's go back into our room oh, that's not what I wanted it get in there so how are we Well, there's nothing in here for us to really do, right? We look at the flame. Can't really use that. What if I used the bellows on the flame again? Nope. How about the dried food box? Ignite the box. I don't think that will burn well, at least not as well as paper. Okay, we'll use my my screw. I don't need this notepad anymore. Yes, I could get the fire to the staff room fireplace using the paper, but I should have a prepared fireplace waiting for me when I get there. It is prepared. Ah, the gas burns with a nice stick, and because it burns, dude. Yes, I. What? What do you mean it's not prepared? What do I need to add to it? Like... Oh... I gotta put the dread box in with the wood so that it ignites with the, with the wood, right? Okay, we're gonna try that first. And then, hopefully we get to the library. That only took an hour. Sometimes you gotta play games like this for you, dude. Okay, put the box in there. I don't need the empty carton anymore. Yep. Paper, wood, now the Good. 
Now it's ready. You, by any chance, have a match? It must be you are a trained. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or were there some gaps in your education about which I should? No, everything's fine. I'll just go get my wand. Mm -hmm. I have no idea how to conjure up fire. We don't need it. We're gonna make a mad dash with a burn notepad to the fireplace. Okay, let's go back to our room. I have a feeling whatever we find in the library is going to be helpful in getting the other kobold and unlocking the display case of which we will automate the broom. Straight up uh, Mickey Mouse style. Uh, okay, flame on. I'll tear a sheet from the notepad into strips. Let's give it a try. Uh. Now, hurry. Yes. Okay. We're going straight there. Just carrying the fire. No problem. Ow! Ah, it's still a long way to the fireplace. Well, let's keep going. Hopefully we still have our fire. Do I still have fire? Don't have fire anymore. Damn it. Still missing a few pages. How am I supposed to get the fire over there? Nothing can be easy, can it? Wait, what's he doing? He keeps looking that room. Thin strips of paper. Can I light the paper with my wand? No. I tore a page from my loose leaf paper. It's quite old and very dry. Yes, I know. It burns like tinder. What can I use to carry the flame over there? I need a box. You know, there's probably a box in my room. Let's take a look. Magic ball. A horn. I am going to need that horn at some point, right? If I walk over here. Any boxes? No boxes. Alright, let's... Let's try to bring the fire one more time. I think. Oh, a nice flame. But how do I get it to the fireplace in the staff room? Well, it's the only thing in here. What can I burn? Maybe I should just throw the fireplace powder on it. I think I tried that already. Alright. Now, hurry! Okay. I'm hurrying. I can't sprint. Still missing a few pages. Still. Why did you put it out, dude? We needed that. Okay. Flame on. Let's go. Now, hurry! Okay. There's nothing else to burn in here, right? There's no way we get out. Oh god, we got out. With the flames on? Still? Oh, we got it. Ah! Mm, I was almost in the staff room. Is there a draft or something? Let's close the window. Okay. One more try, but this time we're going to make a mad dash. So a straight line from here. 
Hopefully it's just really temperamental. Okay, we're here. Now, hurry. Okay. Bro isn't moving any faster. As soon as it opens. Ow! Ah, it's still a long oh, way shit. to the fireplace. All right. I think there's something we gotta do along the way here. We need a better way to keep these flames here. Although maybe it is. This might be one I have to look up. Anyway. It's been about an hour and some change. I think we've done enough relaxing with Mr. Wil Wilbur Weatherby. So I'm gonna call it there. I hope you guys are having a good day or evening or whatever it is for you. Wow, this isn't dust and dirt. It's like the funk of 40,000 years. It's rock art. As if thousands of feet have trampled it into the floor. Even though no one's been here for 20 years. Well, at least as far as I know. How can I ever get the wall cleaned up? Wow, this is even though... Mm -hmm. How can I ever get... Wow, this is even Just though... checking. That was a Michael Jackson reference. Funk, 40,000 years. Mm -hmm. That's gonna do it, guys. Be good to each other, and we'll see you guys for chillaxing probably on Sunday in the next one. Take care.